video is going to be um, my favorite look using my Jaclyn Hill palette. Um, this is one of my favorite palettes. I love Morphe palettes. So I'm super excited to do this video and I've been wanting to do it and I just haven't gotten to it. So today I was like, today's the day. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video and let's and get yeah. started. So basically to get started, I've already done all my face makeup and primed my eyes and everything. I'm going to start with this shade right here. It's like a burgundy-ish color and I'm just going to take my Morphe M433 brush. Looks like this. And I'm going to tap it into the color. Tap off the excess and I'm just going to put it in my crease. I'm just going to go back and forth with windshield wiper mo motions. I'm going to pick up a little bit more color. Tap off the excess. And just go windshield wiper motions back and forth. And I'm going to do the same thing on the other eye. Sorry. Next, I'm going to use the same brush and I'm going to go in and I'm not going to top off the excess. And I'm going to be um, like, I can't even think of the word right now. I swear I've been losing my mind lately. I'm going to be stamping it on my lower um, lid, on the outer part of my lower lid. I'm just going to stamp it here. And you can sort of start to like blend it in towards the inside of your eye just so it's not just like a line. And then you can just blend. blend it out so this part should be darker than in your crease and this look can be created with literally any palette it's just this is my favorite look to do oh, my back itches with the Jaclyn Hill palette and I'm gonna be stamping the same color on this eye on the outer lid also and again you can blend it in but you still want the outside to be darker. Okay, next I'm going to take um, my Stila, um, this, it's a, just like a contour thing. I'm going to take the concealer part of it with just a flat brush. And I'm going to just stamp the concealer on the inner part of my eye. So it's sort of going to be like a cut crease. And you should just stamp it to like right about where like halfway almost about where you start to blend the um, other color. So next what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this e.l.f. Um, eyeshadow brush that looks just like this and I'm going to take this color right here, this like pinkish glittery color and I'm going to spray my brush first. And pick a bunch of it up. And then I'm going to spray it again. And I'm going to stamp that where I put the concealer.
So then it's just right there and then I'm going to do the same thing on the other eye. And you're just pressing it. You're not going to like blend it. Okay, now I'm going to go back with my Morphe M433 with the original color, like the burgundy type color. I'm going to pick up a little bit more and then I'm just going to blend that towards where we put the um, pink glurry color. Just so it looks blended and not just a, like a straight line. <laughs> Next, I'm going to just take this Eco Tools brush, it's fluffy on this side, and I'm going to take this color right here, this like tannish, nudey color, it looks like a transition shade. I'm going to pick some of that up, tap off the excess, and I'm just going to blend like this on the outsides. Oh, my eyebrow. Just so it's not like a harsh line, I'm going to take that and I'm going to blend that in. And if like me just now, I want like a little bit more of this color right here, I'm going to take it and I'm going to go like this. I'm just going to stamp it a little bit. Just so it looks, because you want it to look like a cut crease. Okay, and now I'm going to go back with that Eco Tools brush to pick up that color and just blend it on the edges. And yeah, so that's the eyeshadow. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to throw on some eyeliner and mascara and I'll be right back. So I threw on some of my NYX Matte Liquid Liner and my Maybelline Total Temptation Mascara. And my last thing to do is I'm going to just take um, this brush that I was using, the first color I used, and I'm going to take that. I'm going to put it on um, my lower lash line and I'm just going to blend it in and then up towards my eyeliner. I'm going to do that on both eyes. Oh god, I just got some in my eye. And then I'm going to use where did I even just put that brush? Okay, and then I'm going to use the tannish color I used and I'm going to go on the inner part. And then I'm going to just clean it up with some powder really quickly and I'll be right back. Hey guys, so I just finished doing the look using just black eyeliner on my waterline and putting some mascara on my lower lashes and I used some Kylie gloss on my lips in the shade Exposed. Oh god, my hair looks crazy. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and... I'll see you guys in my next one.